You're listening to Adi Shokbe Live. We're live in Dublin. Just finished the show. Um, Burner Boy live in Dublin. The O3 Arena sold out. Uh, this is an emotional day in Dublin for a lot of Africans, Nigerians, you know, to see an African superstar at, arena, at an arena this big, with close to 10,000 people in the building. That's crazy. Like, I've been to Dublin a couple of times myself, um, and this, without doubt, is the biggest crowd that, um, you know, an Afrobeat superstar is pulled. Again, to be able to experience nights like this is humbling, is an honor. Big shout outs to Coco Ba, you know, DJ Ahmed, the entire team that put this together. Incredible. Burner Boys performance. Like, you know, anybody that's listened to me talk about Burner Boys performance, you know, there's little i haven't said in the past but i'll say this i will watch him perform every time um and i'll pay if i have to he is an incredible performer an outstanding superstar um i think the enemy award that he picked up recently i don't think a lot of people understood how important that award is um that was an award for you know the the best performer in the world in a category that had the likes of billy eilish um and others his stagecraft was you know recognized on a global scale and that is somebody from our culture promoting our music promoting our culture moving around um and doing an amazing job uh, again tonight was incredible the fans absolutely had a mouthful um burner boy was on stage for one hour and probably 40 40 minutes that's a whole lot of songs you know stamina you know the light band the outsiders you know, always incredible shout out B bill gates as well it was just an experience man um you know, I had the honor and pleasure to, to host tonight. Um, I had my brother, Hack, the host, alongside myself. And hey, we felt the crowd, felt the energy. Dublin was an absolute shutdown. Congratulations to all Africans in Dublin. You know, you guys made this happen. And, and this is a reflection of how passionate you are about your culture, about our music, about our superstars especially the African giant came out tonight and you know he didn't disappoint and neither did you um, he goes to Switzerland in tomorrow morning to perform and then he comes back into the UK for Manchester on Sunday and then the day after he heads out to Paris uh, for the 19,000 capacity sold out arena that was a show he killed uh, just before December and they booked him for the same venue again so he's going back to, to you know to shut things down on, on Monday uh, you know of course I am the energy god which means I have a lot of energy but I ain't gonna lie to you man these performers these artists I don't know where to get it from man especially these Afrobeats artists man the way they're touring moving around putting performances in selling the culture promoting the music making us so proud um, yeah, again, we came out to Dublin, we saw, we conquered, it's an amazing night, keep supporting Afro Beats, I'm your boy, Shops to do, and check out my shirt too, because it's um, St. Patrick's Day, we came, came through in the green and white, shout out to my lyrical, you know, baby, he put it on for me, you know, the Nigerian flag, in that African you know, that African map, and then obviously he did the coat of arms. Listen, we're representing Africa, man. Don't, don't get it twisted. Let me, let me try to flip. You know, I had the traditionals, 
and then obviously we have the green white greens too <laughs> that we represent <laughs> don't get it twisted <laughs> shout out to everybody man peace and love the Afrobeats podcast right.